Madam Speaker, today is an important day in the Arrive Scam scandal saga because later today, Min Doan, who is one of the central figures in this affair, will be testifying before the Government Operations Committee. He will be testifying for three hours and required to answer critical questions about how the decision was made to choose GC strategies and who was responsible for that uh, decision. Uh, he will need to answer questions about significant allegations around the destruction of emails. Since his last appearance before the Government Operations Committee, uh, we've seen revelations in the Globe and Mail uh, which uh, note a, an, a, an accusation of unusual steps that he took that led to the destruction of emails at the Canada Border Services Agency. We have an Auditor General's report on the Arrive Scam scandal uh, that shows uh, missing records. Uh, and we also have these allegations uh, filed uh, by a CBSA IT employee obtained by the Globe and Mail, uh, these allegations of moving files in an odd way that led to the destruction of emails and other uh, critical documents. Uh, and uh, this has, of course, as the Globe and Mail noted, particular importance uh, given that we are seeking information about what happened with GC strategies, how they were awarded the contract. Uh, one of the deeply suspicious aspects of the Arrive Scam scandal uh, is that you have nobody actually prepared to take responsibility for the decision uh, to choose GC strategies. Uh, you have a flurry of accusations, very sharp and public accusations among senior public servants, uh, which speaks to significant and enduring challenges at CBSA. Uh, 